hey guys so welcome to my channel um i can't really tell you what this channel is going to consist of um i know i want to have vlogs hair reviews q a story times everybody wants me to do story times but i just felt like my first video the easiest video that i could put out and see how people like it is a hair review video now most of you guys may know i love hair i started getting into wigs making my own wigs um, braiding hair weaves all of that I love it so today I came to do I'm gonna do like this little um I don't know what I would call it a series of hair under a hundred dollars on Amazon so the hair that I'm going to be reviewing today is called I'm sorry this box came so cracked up when I got it but it's I don't know if you guys could see it's Jaja hair 100% human hair wigs, right? So they do vlogs, right? So my first wig that I actually bought a wig from them before. My first wig is an eight inch, so it kind of hits me right here. Really cute wig. Um, wore for my birthday. I'll probably. Eat it. Um, that wig was really cute, and then I was like, hmm, I want a wig that's kind of like natural looking, that is kind of the same length as my hair. Now my hair might be a little bit longer than this, but like who's gonna know? And as you can see, it's a frontal, it's a frontal unit. So um, it was my first frontal unit when I bought it the first time, and I loved it because it was really easy. So I got it, um, I ordered it, and it came within like a week, maybe a week and a couple days. Um, it came in this package here, um, and it came in like a little net, and then it came with these eyelashes here. I tried to put them on for you guys, but I was rushing to do this video, so they look bad. But it came with these um, mink, fake mink lashes, whatever. Um, really cute, real nice. And guys, guess how much this would cost? I got this in a 14 inch. So the original one that I did buy first, which was an eight inch, I think it was like maybe like $64. But guess how much this wig costs? This wig costs seven, let me not lie to you guys, hold on. Because I was freaking out when I saw this. So this is a 14 inch. I did a little bit of curls, but usually it'll come down to like right here, right? I'm assuming that they sold out, but it looks like this. It looks like it's gonna have a picture of that girl there and then it will say like the different lengths so right now I'm guessing that the the bob that I got for this length is out but it was like $76 so I'm like hmm 14 inch $76 like how good is this hair so when I bought it I did some clips I'm gonna look for them again and I bought it I washed it because this is I don't know when you guys are gonna watch this but this was like during corona times we're still in it right now so I got it and I was like uh-uh so I like deep conditioned it and like I like kind of boiled the hair to be honest with conditioner and stuff on it and then I let it air dry now the thing is it advertised this as straight hair but it's like when you wash it, it comes out like a body wave, which is actually nice. I like body wave hair. So if you just wet this, it'll just have like a nice wave. Um, and then I just let it air dry. So after I did that, then I was like, hmm, let me see the knots. So I went and actually bleached it on top of that. So I bleached the knots. Um, I could say they're very hard to bleach because you guys could still kind of see them. What I usually do, and I didn't do yet because I wanted to show you how the knots were. What I usually do is dap it with some makeup, like some concealer or some foundation. And I just go in and dap that up and you won't be able to see. It's not really hard to cover up. But the knots, it takes a long time to bleach. And you know, like usually like when you bleach your hair, it'll turn like blonde like this. Like, no, this wig will turn red. So I had did, I don't know, you guys can't see it, but I did um when i bleached it the hair was like bright red like the knots because you know sometimes you get it on the hair so usually i go back and dye it but the knots were like like bright red so if you wanted to get a red color and you wanted to bleach this hair you could do that now um this hair it bounces back i've washed it two no three times i washed it actually last night because i had too much glue on my lace so i ended up washing the hair three times i used pantene i also use silicone mix on hair just to you know keep it going um not stiff doesn't knot up in the back you know like in the back area doesn't do that really flowy like light like amazing and i buy hair 
like virgin hair and i'm telling you like the quality of this and quality of virgin hair they're kind of going hand in hand because some virgin hair like the wig that i had lasted me like over a year over a year because i had it on my birthday so and that wig's still good and this wig like i just know when i buy her hair like this hair is amazing i wouldn't lie to you guys i would definitely tell you if it was siphon or doing whatever i've had this hair for maybe three weeks now three two weeks whatever um but i can definitely vouch for it being that i had bought a wig from her prior so i think this is a good buy i definitely think it's a lace front um they also have like a patch in the back i don't know if i can show you like there's still hair in the back like a low you know like that you could glue on to the back if you wanted to pull it up into a pony i'm just not that type of girl and i didn't feel like cutting it off so i kind of left it there but you guys are more than welcome to just cut that off in the back i'm gonna show you the front again i don't know about you guys but i i'm i used to be the girl who used to change her wig like every day but like this is my everyday wig i go to sleep in this wig i wake up in this wig i tie my hair down i haven't changed this wig since i bought it so this has gone in it's hot it's summer now so it frizzes just a little bit like if i straighten it next thing you know i have like a little wave here trying to come through but that doesn't really bother me it's not like it's such curly hair that i can't keep it straight. and i just do like little waves like this anyway so it kind of blends in yeah i think this is amazing i'm gonna go and you know insert some clips here and there about oh i'm losing my voice about the hair like how i bleached it and stuff like that just so you guys could see but definitely think this is a buy i'm gonna be doing i think my next wig that i'll do is maybe like some curly hair and all of the wigs that i'll do i'll maybe do like five episodes but all of the like wigs that i do are definitely going to be under a hundred dollars because i'm cheap i'm an everyday woman i don't want to spend a whole bunch of money on hair so for me i want to get some bang for my buck 76 dollars. this is it this is what you get for it they don't have any more um longer lengths for this it just stops at 14 but i mean if you want like a natural look that looks like it will be your hair you could do that now i didn't pluck the part so if you guys are looking at my part i didn't pluck it i usually don't pluck my parts because with the wig when you pluck it it um hair and you actually bleach it as well hair tends to like fall out quickly and i don't want a wide part i want to use this as long as possible this will thin out by itself and the part will get wider the more you use and the more you part it so what i do i'll do it a part in the middle and then part in the side just kind of switching it up so it doesn't thin out as quickly but this is amazing it doesn't itch they do have combs there's combs so there's this is the the, the frontal and i think it ends like a right yeah it ends like here they do have like i think two combs here and one comb all the way in the back i don't use the combs here um i use the comb in the back just to latch it underneath because they have um they do have a elastic band so what i'll do is i'll just pull it underneath the elastic band just so it could stay but like this wig is steady i do my baby hairs all of that i cut these baby hairs they don't come with baby no they don't come with baby hairs but it kind of comes pre-plucked so you don't have to worry about that cutting the baby hairs cut them you know to the length of this and then just soup them um, up i love it honestly i love the wig i can't say anything bad what about I can it say is i wish they came in different lengths because i would definitely go longer um just being that the hair quality is so good but hey if you guys are cheap like me and you guys want to have a good wig that can last you six months to a year like they said or even longer depending on how you treat it go ahead like this is a buy i'm gonna put the link in the description um and yeah if you guys want to see more videos from me whether it be um a hair video or whether it be like a q a a vlog or whatever like let me know like just like the video i mean this is my first video so i'm not gassing it up but we'll see i'm probably gonna like record another video after this something different um and let's see what feedback i get if people like me on youtube i'm gonna stay on youtube and i'm gonna do more hair reviews if y'all don't like me then 
I'm gonna still post. <laughs> I'm gonna still post because I feel like I can I can make it out here. So, um, or if you're a hair company and you want me to review your hair, I will definitely do that. Um, and I'll put like my email and stuff on the bottom. But thank you for joining me, guys. I know it's like a short video, but I just felt like I need to get to the point about the hair. So, um, subscribe. It's my first video.